What's going on YouTube? Today we are doing something special. We are going to be interviewing the one and only Asgul, otherwise known as Adam. Hello. How are you doing, Adam? Very nice. How are you doing, Andy? I'm doing pretty good. So like, you. So basically, right. like, you decided to get up at like 1 a.m. to, you know, do this. No, it's like actually 9. 25 a.m. Well, yeah, we have different time zones, but like you decided to like get up early because you just saw that I was online So I'm like, uh, no, something I, was, I wasn't actually sleeping to be honest. Oh, you were just, so you just left Um, Maybe I was I don't know. I just need to rest I think <laughs> okay, and then you ended up going and walking around So how do you feel about getting caught by the police because I know you're stupid and doing a bunch of I just want to know Wait, 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 um, just repeat that because I, I, I didn't hear you clearly. Do you think you'll get caught doing stupid stuff by the police? Because, let's be honest, you're not um, smart, you're dumb. I don't think so. Y you don't think so? You're dumb. <laughs> okay, what are we I talking about? So let's get, all right, what are we talking about? Let's get into this. All right, I'm going to ask you this. How about this? Would you, This just came to my mind right now. Would you rather sit on a warm toilet seat or a cold toilet seat? There is... This is like... I know where you where are you going with this. There's um everything goes have like two, like you know you have coin and the coin have two sides and everything has two sides of it. Hey. Okay, let's start with cold one. Okay, cold is cold, which is not nice, but at least you have like this like you are sure that nowhere like like I don't know like someone were putting their fucking butt cheeks on this. <laughs> uh, some, but you have fuck you're sure that no one did that in the like last two hours. Or yeah, yeah. But for me, like but it, it really. When you're sitting on warm one, it's like more comfortable. But like at the same time, it's less comfortable because you're being like fuck. Someone just were shit in here. <laughs> that's not uh, nice. But it also really depends on the, on the like situation. Like if it's the middle of the night, you want a warm toilet seat. But like whenever it's like. Like, you know, yes. you've been doing work, you just got home, and you, you probably want a cool toilet seat to have the cool sensation, you know? Yeah. Uh, then, do you know that in Japan, they have uh, heaters in toilet seats? What? They have heaters in toilets? Yeah, they I mean, have well, heaters in, like, toilet seats. I mean, well, so I don't... that way it's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's, you know, warm. I know Japan is, like, all, like, futuristic, but, like, that stuff is crazy, to be honest. Alright, so... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's it's just Japan. Japan, I, it's like you know, it's a very futuristic place. But places like Tokyo, like I heard, like are very like expensive compared to America. Like you thought America was expensive, Tokyo is even worse, bro. Uh, like, you, like I don't know if you've never been there, but I've I've seen stories like apparently like a, a ten minute drive is like a hundred bucks in a cab. Oh, uh, I mean, like, not, bro. In LA, in LA, the cab prices are basically the same, <laughs> bro. And you could, bro, honestly, like for a hundred bucks, you could get ten, ten, um, ten dollar BJ's from Poland, as you say, from your school. Oh man. Or, or you could get. Or you, you don't can, have to be recalculating it like that. <laughs> or you can get so nine. Ten dollar BJ's in Poland. Or you can get nine. Yeah, that's true. You can, in Poland, you can easily get ten dollar BJ <laughs> if you come like. If you recalculate our currency, that's gonna be like around ten dollars. Yes. Or, or you can go to Vietnam and get a fifteen dollar VJ instead. Or I DP, but <laughs> nah, I didn't. I stole that from it's Full from, Metal like, Jacket. It, like probably you guys don't know where is it from. It's from the movie Full Metal Jacket, and there yeah. was a scene that there was like you know they were like fucking in Vietnam, so they were like soldiers, and this like Vietnam is like. Poker, like come up to them and she's being like me so horny. <laughs> me so horny. And like me, bucks. me take care of you. Me love you forever. Fifteen dollars. Yeah. Like my mama only. Lets, my mama I, only lets me spend five dollars. And we check the like how much is worth fifteen dollars from nineteen sixteen, from like sixties. Uh, fuck nineteen sixties, sixties. Um, and it was around hundred fifty bucks. So that's kind of. Expensive. Yeah. But like <laughs> today's money. You get you get what you pay for. That's a that was a whole Vietnamese girl. So yeah. <laughs> Bro, I still find it like it's just like how do I say this? I mean, you could. 
it, nothing. Just fifteen dollars. I mean, it seems so cheap, but like in reality, it's like a hundred, bro, for like them. And also yeah, the fact did. that she wanted fifteen U.S. dollars. That's in Vietnamese money. That's probably like a million bucks. I ain't gonna lie. I don't. Yeah, like, Thousand years ago, people were making like maybe ten bucks more bro. for a week. I don't know, bro. <laughs> And because also, because I don't know my geography, all I know is Poland has like a liter of Wotowto, like their cash is called that or something like that, bro. Water, it's called Zwotówka. Water? Zwotówka, you have 100 Zwotówka, like Zwotówka, like this, I just typed it. Kalachi? Zwotówka. Zwotówka, you can say Zwotówka, like 100 Zwotówka is like 20 bucks. Um, yeah. Like, it's not even nice to like compare because you have like cost of living in US and Poland are, are obviously different, like much different. So yeah, like it's like around that, like I wouldn't say it's perfect, but like, yeah. Hey, I just want to ask you, I know this is completely off topic, but like why'd you make your character a black version of me, bro? Nah, that's not a black version of you. Yeah. Like, at the start, that was a black version of you. I mean, I'm still the Sigma but one. They you suck. That this Hairstyle is nice, but it's black and not. I'm not one of you, bro. I literally don't. That's not my point. Yeah, that is your point. Oh my god, I'm lagging. But, um... And it's topic like, you guys know what he's doing? Like, whichever time we like play for himself, no. and being like, oh, no. I got like four people recognizing me. Because okay. I do, I actually got and some people like, recognizing me. I've never seen you getting recognized, maybe once. Okay. Did, didn't you make that one girl give you sucka sucka in that um unreleased video? Yeah. <laughs> like, we don't have to talk about that. No, 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 it's because you get no bitches, Adam. Hey, you're, you're gay, bro. <laughs> okay, but this is podcast, we're not supposed to fight here we can, we can talk can yes we are that's what we're supposed to do we're just talking and shut up you're gay too all right but um so remember how like you used to hate south london i mean you still hate it you probably hate it even more than you did back then but like what encourages you to just get on with me um um i just pretty much came back from i was walking my sister to kindergarten i believe and i've seen you like online this kind i was like fuck this. I'm getting on. Well, no, I'm talking about just normally on South London because I know you hate this game and I'm pretty sure I know the reason why you get on because it's like the only game I play and you can't play anything else with me. But like, I'm, Bro, talking, about, I'm, I'm talking about other reasons, alright? I don't hate this game. I hate more of the people who are featuring. It's more game, the community. Like this, 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 like, it's more the community. FT Cloud and FT Drippy did a good job on this game. Like, this is a like everything if this game would be better if the community wouldn't be so fucked up. Like look at this bro, all That's the true. all the animations are clean and everything. Like this is a good game, bro. Just yeah, the this community. Is a good game, very nice, but it's like fucking money hungry. Yeah, that's the only real problem. Like, At least they're reducing prices. But like money hungry, as you say, if you go click on the shop, Gold Draco is four. Like, you get like turf, bro. It's four thousand dollars. Like, for something, you gotta spend like I don't know five hundred bucks, which is fucked up price because like I don't know what the fuck what the world is that but for 500 bucks they're like bro like you know what I mean this yeah. is just not worth it those are bro, just fucking th pixels 3,000 3, pounds for almost for 800 robux and then yeah. what? wait 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 go to the shop and then the starter pack it's um 500 um, I think this is actually a reasonable price. Revolver, no, and the five. Wait, revolver, the... wait, revolver, wait, 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 wait. Revolver, like, spawn? No, just regular revolver. You'll get a revolver, five thousand pounds, and an SUV car. I think that's a reasonable price because the SUV car is actually a pretty nice car, bro. It's the cheapest. Oh, but... it's five hundred. It's five hundred, not eight hundred. Yeah, I said five hundred. The um, what's eight hundred is three thousand pounds. That's eight hundred. Oh, wait. 5k Okay, yeah. that's 170 Wait, 3000 pounds Some of the stuff I do Same see over two What? Bro I know, this game no, can't be money hungry But I'll admit, some things are cool Like, Spawn of Silence Glock I might, I would actually do that Like, that's that's cool An yeah. axe I, I haven't seen an axe in forever, bro So I might actually spawn one in soon and use it Or just buy one from the shop But this stuff's actually cool Silence Glock, that's nice 
Bro, I remember the old old days of this game, bro. Like this game used to be like so cool. You used to be able to click to enter stuff. The like yeah, all the guns yeah, were clean. I, I, bro, I've never played those times, but like yeah. yeah, I did. But like I don't know, like bro, I don't know why they got rid of this. But whenever you used to shoot a gun, smoke would come out of the barrel, bro. Like after you're done shooting it. And like I remember the way that you used to hold a gold Draco. Like you used to grab it, you used to extend your arms and started collapsing it. Like you would extend your arms, like how normally people hold it, and it would like go back and it would hop, bro. I remember that. But yeah, it's more strict today than it usually. It's more strict today than it has ever been. But it is what it is, man. Honestly. Yeah. But I feel like Wait, the. You can buy in the shop, is that like one time spawn or just like spawn? It's, it literally says one use only. Instant spawns, it's a one use only. Wait, 4k for gold Draco, bro. I have like two gold Dracos in my safe. I know, I have and one. I, I have one. I also have one. I, I got admin guns yeah. too, but I'm probably gonna have to hand those in eventually. But if anyone's whitelisted, send me a message, send a comment, join my gang in the description, exactly. and send a link and like say, hey man, I got whitelist, and send me some proof that you have whitelist. I'm not giving you a you gun, it, it gun. disappears. Like, he can't use it. Like. I can't use it, I don't know why I have it. I have a Supreme Glock and a Glock Switch! But yeah. There's someone that's a whitelist and wants fucking Supreme Glock or Glock Switch and just hate it came up. Yeah. Basically. Okay then, let's go back to the podcast. What I... do you think about some sketchy situations with, I believe, bias and F and FND cloud? You know what I mean. Okay, we, we're probably gonna get banned for talking to us. Bias, I feel like bias, he, I'm sorry to say this, but bias is like, he, I, I swear to God, he's a wannabe Mike from Total Drama, bro. This dude has like 18 personalities. He can, he could be a 20 year old drunk old man, or he could be a whole freaking 12 year old. I literally encountered the 12 year old version. And then there's FNT Cloud, bro. I saw the, I saw that one video that you sent me. It says if you're, if you're a girl below 13, please DM me. Bro. I send it to you. I send it to you. Yeah, I saw that, bro. That was funny. But FT Cloud, I don't and think it's FT a... FT Cloud actually commented this with like eyes emoji or something. Oh yeah, I saw that. The actual FT Cloud commented. But um... Yeah. Because like, it's funny. Bias, I don't know bro. Like this dude has like 18 personalities. He could have a personality of like 15 E-kittens or one where he's just chill. But the dude well, is no, actually... I'm, I'm right, I would rather wanted to talk about like... They're like... They... They just like 13 year old girls, bro. Oh, that's not that, that. Okay, that's F and C Cloud, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bro. Okay, that's the one right? yeah, There's someone else too, I forgot their name, but they, bro, they are littered with Ekins, bro. Like, you gotta see this, bro. I don't know who it is, but I forgot their name. Bias knows who it is, but it's this one dude, bro. He has like 14 million Ekins, bro. And they're all like 12 and 13, bro. It's so fucked up. Yeah. FNC Cloud, he's just an Edgar, bro. I've seen the dude. Like, I've, I don't know if they're real pictures, but. It's literally oh, like. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's. I, a, I, I need. I have no from fucking gay like that, bro. Bro, an Edgar with curly hair with a chain who's skinny and smoking a cigarette. Oh, I don't know. Oh man, I. Know, <laughs> bro, you're literally describing something I knew in my fucking eighth grade, bro. Bro, what if that's him, bro? <laughs> like, like everyone knew that, like before the pandemic, that he like changed it. Everyone knew that this nigga was like just fucking nigger, like stupid ass. And then he just decided to be Edgar, and he still looked us, and he was like raising up six graders. <laughs> and that was like, pathetic. Bro, Everyone F just fucking make fun of him. That's F and C yeah. Cloud. That's, that's fucking Edgar, bro. That's F and C Cloud, bro. And I've seen these Edgars at my school. They can't fight for shit, man. Like I'm sorry, they can't. Bro. I've fucking passed I've... them once in the face, and you're gonna cry that you. Ruin their makeup, bro. Now, what they do, they always try to wrestle. Like, whenever they pick me up, like, I'm doing wrestling, so, like, when someone actually picks me up and tries to slam me, I know exactly what to do. And I end up grabbing their foot, slamming, and they slam their own face in the ground. They're like, <laughs> something like that. You know what's funny about, like, Edgar guy, you? Huh? He were actually just, like, uh, he, he were doing, like, fake freckles, if you know what I mean. Uh -huh. like, fucking look like some, look like some, I don't know. Some fucking makeup, fucking you know shit, and it looked us, but he was like proud of it on like Instagram and shit, and he was like, uh, just like, he was trying to convince people on Instagram that the freckles he had were actually real, even though it was fucking bullshit. <laughs> Adam, I don't want to hear you. I don't. I don't. Wanna... Like... 
Huh? I, I don't want to hear you commenting on people's looks, bro. You look like a monkey. <laughs> Bro, you look like a fucking Indian. <laughs> you used to look like a monkey because you had short hair, but now you don't. Yeah, you used to look like a monkey. All right, and I I am an Hispanic, but I'm not an Edgar, bro. Like, who actually becomes an Edgar? Bro? That's, that's that's like gay. All right, well, um, so Adam, what do you think about the admin situation of people just getting banned for no damn reason? Wait, can you repeat this? Well, okay. Hold on. I'm gonna put my mic a little bit closer. Well, no, no, no. I gotta keep it this far. But I was saying, what do you think about the admin situation? Like, about how the Roblox admins are doing? Like, people just getting banned for no reason. Oh, I hear about that. And this is fucked up because there are people out there who spend like thousands of dollars on this game um, and getting banned. I, I, I've seen like a video when people that have like certain phrase or like certain like letters in like you know order in their username they get like banned yeah for like no reason permanently banned and uh yeah this is fucked up because there are people who are spending money and they i fucking know get bro banned. they could actually fucking get sued by i believe by that i've been they banned get, bro like, i've been banned for stupid reasons and these are valid reasons but getting banned for calling someone gay like bro Oh just, my god, I remember when we were like once playing on Please Donate, I believe, and we were, there was just like some stupid kid that were like eight people were making fun of, just like on voice chat, and like we got both, I believe, we got banned. I got believe banned for just like voice chat harassment. Oh, I remember that. That was so bad. That was back in December. That was December 21st. I remember that exact date for a reason, because like, so yeah, like for a reason for a reason i can i'll tell you guys the reason in a bit but um basically what happened like so like there is this song now this was messed up what we did we were not at all in justice to do this this was like oh. fucked up but so this there little like this little 11 like, know, 10 <laughs> he's like a, he was 11 he was 11 at the time okay and, and like he was, i believe like telling something to sister of some like some he, he, girl uh, let, player, me, let, me, let me let me just get up. He was going to some like to some like 15 year old girl's little sister and just doing this, bro. <laughs> and he was saying, "Get up, yeah, 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 And I was like, and then, and then then her sister just went on the mic and started just like, uh, you know, crying and freaking like, out. You know. Like, why does your little sister, who's like three, have a freaking microphone? <laughs> In exactly. But then and like, then, like I had we had a people. Some people were at the start actually being like to this guy like what the fuck and shit But like after like one minute when she just goes fucking full car in mode Everyone was saying shut the fuck up Like, like bro, fucking, I, you know, like fuck you and your sister bro like, like at this point like, we don't care Cause like she was and, like, making she, she made that little dude cry bro like so we had to do something yeah, about it she actually made him cry and <laughs> that was um, funny yeah like we got banned for like i got burned but i believe for three days i got a warrant yeah i got yeah, one but yeah we met a few people including this one dude named cornelius um lee which um one of my um friends named lee and then um we met this other dude named sammy i don't talk to him anymore but um but yeah the day was significant because you know christmas was four days or later and um a lot happened basically and so, um, yeah. yeah, that day was pretty special because, you know, the person I was talking about, Lee, me and her were actually together for a bit, but we eventually, you know, ended not too, not too um, long ago, but it was, that's why that day was significant to me, because the first day we met, so, like, I find that day actually pretty special. I know it wasn't, it was, like, last year, like, you know, bro, crazy to think that we met last year, man. Yeah. Everything was last year, bro, like, 2022, bro. But, yeah, it was, like, Oh, it was, and I remember me, I know. I don't know why do I think it's like that that I kind of like I feel nostalgic to the bad time that, that I don't know I feel nostalgic to the times that were actually not that well I don't know why bro yeah it all I don't the know why grade, grade, but bro I it wasn't fucking nice but yeah bro honestly but yeah I've seen you from eighth grade you see me from eighth grade I've I have matured a lot since eighth grade but yes bro. Honestly, <laughs> the end of 2022 like, was probably like the best year. Like December was, um, 2022 December was the best year. Was like the best month of my life, and I don't think of, I can't think of anything else. I was like the best. That, 
December, like December was like the best part of my life. I met Adam. I had met one of my no, own. No, you met me like. Mm, no, we met in December. I we we met in December. December? Yeah, we met in December. Yeah. I December twenty twenty two. I believe it was like in the words before the same fucking November. I forgot fucking uh, yeah stupid Polish nigga. I forgot yeah. Month. After September, but before November, was it there? I don't know. I know we met in December, bro. Good. Yeah. Okay. December was I literally know. was literally the um like best part, bro. Like December was the best. December 22 was the best month of my life. I had met Adam. I had met my um girlfriend at the time. I had met like these cool dudes, like you know these some um, cool people. It was a friend group. We don't talk to each other anymore. It's like I don't know. We just stopped talking to each other. I met this. I met the little dude Sammy, and I got donated a crap ton of Robux at that time. So that was like a I good remember we, were just like, we met on actually fucking please donate. We met on please donate, yeah. And the reason we met, cause we were we were just being degenerates. We were betting money on who was gonna beg us for Robux. Like, hey, I bet you that I bet five Robux that guy's gonna beg you. And we're like, yeah, I bet you oh, too. It's, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, that's so damn well. <laughs> Bro, and so I, being degenerates, I was just like, I was just like, I believe with some. You were wearing some Walter White stuff, bro. Yeah, I would fucking get Walter White Avatar. Um, I bought that one too, and then I put on a super cell outfit, bro. It was, oh man, to think that, oh, that yeah. to think that that was uh, like seven months ago. That was almost a year ago, bro. Yeah. Oh man. No, not a year ago. Yeah, around January, January, around like January, like the beginning was when my happiness peaked, bro, because everything was going amazing, bro. Like, I had my girlfriend at the time, bro. I had friends. Me and Adam were, like, freaking starting YouTube and stuff like that. We had our... We, like, had everything, bro. Like, everything was going great. It did go downhill at the end of January and February when it went very downhill. But then around March, I ended up turning 15. And everything's going back up. Now I have a lot, you know, going on, basically. And I'm happy with what I got right now. And yeah. I'm starting to grow, you know. We're twenty percent way to getting monetized. I'll make a dollar per video. Yay! Ah <laughs> yeah, man, nice, we're, we're, we're making a dollar per video. I don't think you're gonna make. Wait. I wanna. Yes, I think you make. You'll make. Dollar per video. <laughs> you'll make a dollar per video. Like you'll make a dollar if you make a thousand views on a video of when you're monetized. Like everything's going back up. Everything's going good. Being YouTuber, it is kind of draining, but honestly, it's worth it. But like people, yeah. I know. Like I know, he's fucking captain. Like he's just saying, oh, that much people recognize me. Just like, people are actually okay. starting to recognize me, man, and I'm honestly getting happy about it. However, all right, all right. there are some people who take advantage of that. They'll ask for guns. They'll try to buy off me. I'm oh, not. Oh, I'm not. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm not a dealer, so don't ask to buy off me, man. Just find someone else, please. I hate whenever I get DM'd, but besides that, honestly, being YouTuber is great. I love my fans. I love all of them. We're like everything's going good. Sorry, I have chalk in my mouth. I'm eating right now. <laughs> what? Nah. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Um. Uh. So Adam. Is that my music or not? <laughs> okay, I got confused. I thought it was an actual dude talking. You may have never believed in your oh wait, that's an yeah, ad. I, that's an advertisement, bro. I'm gonna have to. <laughs> okay, okay. Wait, what's going on? Um, an advertisement is playing on my music, bro. <laughs> of course, this has to happen. This is not my music, bro. This is an advertisement. No. I'm just gonna let it pass. But anyways, Adam, I just wanna know, like, so you said eighth grade was like bad for you, right? I know this is part of the personal, but like, what happened, bro? I know. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna fucking tell. In eighth grade, uh, oh my fucking God, I I wanted to be ashamed of myself. Well, that was like a piece of shit, bro. I um I remember I had friends at the time in school, but I wouldn't I would like believe that they weren't my friends. They were fake. And I actually once told them that fuck you guys, you're not my fucking real friends. And then um. 
I was like the worst person possible. So you were gay. I was just like, my fucking. I would like be in school and like talk to no talk. Fuck, I can't speak. Talk to nobody. I was like piece of shit. I wasn't. I was. I was like I don't know like twenty pounds lighter. I had absolutely no muscle. I couldn't do even fucking one. Like I don't think I could do one proper push up at the time. And you still can't do like, a push up. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> I, can do like I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> I couldn't do a fucking push up. I was like kind of fucking stupid. I was like, what they were doing? I know, I played Fortnite for like a month or a week. I know. Um, and I had fucking gay as grades, which fucking made me. Uh, I have I have gay ass grades. You don't even go to school anymore. You just start stop. You just stop going after that out. No, I fucking have this. Yeah, like like bro, you might as well drop out at this point because you're gonna get arrested for truancy, man. I don't gotta drop out, man. Um, that's just a one year problem. You can still doing shit. So like, yeah. Uh So well, basically, yeah. what's going on? What was going on? That was a piece of shit. Um. I was like the worst person you can talk to. I would like, I, 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 I don't know. I couldn't like speak to a human properly. I was just like you were retarded. Spending. I was retarded. <laughs> I didn't more than that. Well. I couldn't actually talk. My friend, that I'm actually like good friend now, like my best friend from like first grade or something. Yeah. I would like fucking. He actually like I know I hated him for like months. I know, he, he, I don't think he gave a fuck to be honest, probably not, I wouldn't Wait. give a fuck too. So he's like, gay? Yeah. No, he's not gay bro, he's only, bitches. Only gay people just don't care about people's opinions? No, 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 no. look, he was like fucking giga nigga chad. Yeah, but if he's like trying uh, to brush it yeah. off and act like a tough guy, then like you're gay. But if you just ignore it, like you don't say anything back, then yeah, yeah, that 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 that's me. He was, bro. That's me. That's nah, he wasn't. Nah, nah, I don't think like he is fucking ripped. He's like fucking sportsman and shit. But nah. he's like not violent, but he's like you know nah, fucking I peaceful. I would be his he's, ass. He's like very religious, you know, just like very nice thing up. I would beat your ass. I would beat his ass. Nah. You wouldn't, bro. <laughs> yeah, like pro fucking probably six not. Foot. That six foot is not that tall. I'm literally like, it's like six my brother foot, is. He's like, uh, I say, hundred wait, eighty kilo. Oh shoot, that. I eight... know eighty kilo. So he's fat as shit. No, he's fucking ripped. One hundred eighty kilo. That's like that's like almost three hundred pounds. That's like almost three hundred pounds. I hope you know that, bro. Three hundred pounds is hundred fifty kilo. What the fuck are you talking about? You just about? said one hundred eighty kilos. I said 80 kilos. Okay, well you sound stupid. All right, uh. Okay. <laughs> it just sounds stupid, but yeah, I understand. No, I tried to like count it to pounds, but I don't know like exact pounds, so I just decided to give you kilos, so it's 80 kilos. Yeah. So nah, you wouldn't fucking be kids up. Yeah. About height, it wouldn't really matter if he's six foot because like, you know, like, my, bro okay, my, bro my brother, like, bro my brother's six foot. My brother, my brother's six foot, and he, he yeah, I know, my brother's six foot. So like he, and he barely towers over me. So I'm probably like five foot ten now. But despite weight, he probably You're would. Not five foot ten, I did. Probably, I, my brother barely towers over me. He's like, I feel like I'm up to his like ear. I'm above his ear now, bro. Like my head. So I'm, okay. I'm taller. I'm almost. Well, as tall I'm still here. above my six foot friend's ear, but like he's still fucking higher. My brother barely higher now, honestly. But that dude, like you were saying, he probably still beat me in terms of weight because I am not doing good in weight, bro. <laughs> I don't think he would kick you, to be honest, because he's not he probably just at all. he probably would just let me kick his ass, and since he's religious and wouldn't do that. No, I don't like. I don't think he wouldn't defend himself, but I don't think he would like kind of like hurt too much because like uh, I don't know. I mean, you you wouldn't do anything. You you would you look like Kaba from Dragon Ball Super. You're skinny. What if I show up with a knife, though. Nah, I'm joking. I mean, you're you're a sleeping pill. You look skinny, but in reality, you have muscle. I don't understand how that works, but that yeah, actually that, that, exactly the same, bro. that's a literal thing. But yeah, yeah I have that too. So I have pretty good arm. My forearms are like three times the size of my biceps. I have huge forearm muscle. I don't know why. Okay. 
Like I have a small oh. bi I have a small bicep muscle, but good forearm muscle. I think it's because the pu pull ups and push ups. Yeah. I gotta balance. I do like mostly push ups. That's I really gotta balance yeah. that out because my my I do not have a lot of bicep muscle, but I have a ton of forearm. I gotta balance that out, but I like wait I like to do fucking plank as well uh, because it trains uh, chest like stomach. Yeah. Oh, that's very important, uh, you know, exercise because, you know, stomach is very like, if you're trying to like do more pull-ups, your stomach is actually working because it, I know how it fucking works, but it's like better to like lift your own weight. Mm -hmm. uh, like, I also want to ask you this because this, this was different for me. How did you feel when you first started self London? Like, what was your feeling? Oh, I remember. Mm, I was playing with you. Like, nah, I just curiously joined you because I was interested. What the fuck is this guy playing? He was like in no, December. You were a girl, and, bro. Uh, <laughs> it turns out in South London. When I first joined the game, my game didn't load properly, so I could like what the heck was the that? Walls. I couldn't see avatars and shit, and I was just like running in random direction because I didn't fucking see the map because it didn't load properly. And Adrian was fucking running, chasing me down with fucking knife. <laughs> and I remember that I accidentally made a girl fucking character. And she couldn't change that. So he, he was kind of sassy, you know what I mean? He's gay. <laughs> shut up, shut and, up. And uh, yeah, there was like very fun at the beginning. If your avatar's uh, a girl, it's not gay. Like, until he figured out how like, to. Until, <laughs> until he figured okay, out what to do. Okay, shut up. I'm just, you know, kind of sorry. Say, and yeah, say, first week say was like very fun, but like for there, it just started to like be in fucking routine, just like doing the same shit over and over and over. And... Adam, don't actually say that. I'm joking. If you say that, it kicks you from the game. Don't say that. I, I know you. I know you're about to type in it. Don't say that. It's gonna kick you from the game, dude. And you're gonna lose your gun. Why? I don't know why it says no, or I forgot what it says after it kicks you. Just don't say it, bro. You're gonna get I kicked. I won't do this, bro. Like... You're gonna get kicked. But yeah, um, the music died. I'm not doing. All right, but when I first saw, I don't know what the feeling was, cause when I first started out, I had to progress. Like I didn't, I, w I didn't start off with pro friends. I started off doing a job at sports shop and working at urban, getting money. I got my first gun and then immediately died with it because some dude started to fight and I thought I could kill him with that Ruger. But I didn't kill him with that Ruger. I Ruger. And so someone, and so I bought a Mac off My someone. first guy was actually, I believe, Gold Drake or something. Because I had given I it to you. I know, it did like a thousand times at uh, this point. Because I had given it to him, yeah. But like, honestly, when I first started off, I had to be on my own. Like, I did not have any admin friends, anyone. I had to progress. And I had to, you know, do everything, basically. I had to work on a job. Why did you start the call? Huh? Where do you start? I, th I started around September 2022. Alright. I think so, yeah. That's the time when whitelist wasn't a thing and admins were chill. But RK was still pretty p common, just not as common as today. Like, I started before the Vector came out and all that. Way before the Vector and all that. Before the Vector? Yeah. And I remember so, like, how... 20, 20 the Vector came out, I don't know when it came out, I have to look, but honestly, this game, I didn't even know there was a whole Discord server, I, I knew that there was like gangs and all that, but like, I, when I first started out, I did not know what to expect, the, the map was so huge, I remember I bought fists, and I got to my first fist fights, one I ended up losing, and one I didn't win, when I first started off, um, the ground punch, I'll just show you, um, this didn't actually do damage, like, it wouldn't hit your opponent, it was broken for a bit, so you had to stomp your opponents out. But, um, All right. and back in the day, um, you wouldn't always land fist shots. Like, stand up real quick. Like, stand up real quick. Hold on. I'm not going to hit you in the face. See, like, how I'm hitting you in the body? That would actually count as a hit, and you would get hurt. You would get... There was body shots and face shots. Same thing with ground right. punching. So, there's only face shots now? Yeah. Just, like, stomping. You see how, like, you're going, mm, mm, and you're getting hurt no, a little bit? No, it doesn't do a thing. It doesn't do a thing. Wait, like, so there's only face... Yeah. I don't even know. Wait, let me just, like... Let me just see if that's a face oh, shot. Oh wait, let me the body. Oh shoot! Shoot! No, he's only keeping head. 
Yeah, see? There used to be body shots, and whenever you fell down, you used to be able to ground punch their body instead of their face. It was like stomping, but you used to be able to ground punch their body. But anyways, I'm not gonna make it up. But that's how it is. That's how it was back then. Uh, I'm gonna be right back in like two minutes, okay? Alright. Like, we're gonna cut that out. Be right back. Right, that song is over. Alright. I'm just gonna wait for him. <laughs> I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Okay. Hold on, hold on. You there? Shh. Hold on. And I'm back. Alright, we're gonna okay. cut that. We're gonna cut that out of the video. Anyways, sorry technical is technical difficulties. Anyways, as we were saying, the old days of South London. Like, I still remember whenever the ground punch, you had to punch people in the face to take them out. You could stomp their body yeah. out, but stomping someone's body out did like one damage per stomp and per punch. And your heal was very fast back then, too. And they actually reverted this. Oh. Um, you remember, this is what the old hook always looked like. They, but then back, um, they did change it to a small hook where you used to go like, e eh, and a tiny hook. Because back then, the, the hook was very broken. Like, it wouldn't hit your opponent. It would go through them. You would have to zoom in. And not many people knew that, so they had so they had changed the hook to a tiny little hook. It was like yeah and yeah, and so that's different now. And they actually made it to where you could do a new ground punch. Like, it's it's a lot different. I I know the new ground punch, but I'm not gonna say it because it is very OP. But I'll, I'll show Adam in a bit later. But um, okay. Let me sit down. It's a very OP ground punch. It does like 10 damage per punch, so you'll knock someone out easily once they're on the ground. But um, so. Just the older days of South London were nice, man. Like, RK was gonna thank the police officers, though. That is one thing. They were, there was a lot of good police officers. Like, they were, they were, you know, they did their jobs. They role played. But back then, you used to be able to get CK by an officer. Yeah. Now, mm, now that doesn't now, happen. Like, police, there's, there's very few police officers actually playing. Yeah. Like, you know, there's I can find one server. There's only two, you know. Or like one. Yeah, and half the time it's an S it's usually yeah. like SEOs and like SBs because SB is so easy to get now. You just gotta play Future Tops and same thing with SEO, just Future Tops. But Met, you have to actually get trained for that. So there's not a lot of Met. Oh yeah. Yeah. But like but, I remember, I I know that this game would actually roll play like in the you know old days. Yeah. Most people role play like. Even I used to roleplay. I used to do this. Like, hold on, let me just type this in real quick. I like I used to do things like this all the time when I first got my firearm because I loved roleplaying. I still love roleplaying. It's such a good roleplaying is so nice, bro. Like, honestly, I don't know why people don't roleplay. And like, yeah. basically, I would like I would do this right here. Um, let me just type this in. I don't. I used to copy and paste this all the time because I I took roleplaying seriously. I liked it. Um, I'm just gonna type that in. Wait, wait. I would copy and paste this right here. I would do something like this. Me pulls off fire on flicking the safety off, ready to fire. I would do that, and I would like role play and like rob people and all that. It was so fun when I got my first firearms. Okay. And I also used to do the really? same thing, but instead of me full higher, I would say like me pulls out, me pulls out shank or, or you know. And now the only time really. of role play I do is me. <laughs> <laughs> nah, this is better. It doesn't even appear. Hmm? Me, but 
That's the only time. But half the time we that's all the girls here are dudes. Back in the day, girls who chose girl character people who chose girl girl characters were girls. Like there's no there was no dudes that tended to be one uh, back then. They get any like sexual like they are getting salty from that for like getting no. DJ to like Back in the day they didn't do that. Do. Girls were treated a little bit better as they are in South London than they are today. Because people, like, kids used to play this game, and kids still play this game, but it's more of, like, hood little, it's more of hood kids going, like, bro, going, like, you, yeah, like, you can't understand them nowadays. Like, they're, like, too pussy to, like, be gone, That's yeah. the, like, they go to South yeah. London. But, yeah, girls, just, like, 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 whenever you saw a girl character in this game back then, like, that was an actual girl, usually. Sometimes there would be people, like, Flamingo, yes, he actually did South London videos, um, like he would, he actually had a girl character, but he would make it so obvious that it was him. Yeah. Like, it was cool. You may have never realized that that's what we were ah man, I got what is it? Like, I, I think there's actually South London one. Have never believed there is a South London one, but it's so trash. Like South London one is trash. I've played it before, and it's still money hungry. But South Whoa. London one, you like, would start out. You would start off as a 13 year old, but the game was so full of life back then. Yeah. I don't know why. I think I made it to the front page too. Yeah. Of what? Um, on Roblox. I made it to the front page, I think. South London 1, because it was a roleplay game. You could still get guns, and I think you couldn't. I don't know if you could kill people with the guns, though. I think you just had them. I think you could kill people. You know what they've seen? Yeah. I've seen, uh, so like, there's like this YouTuber, I mean, like, Roblox with this part. like, he's more of like, like, new features, like, new, like, stamps and shit, and he was in the video, when for the one frame, there was some, because he was like, talking about like, some YouTubers that trying to be, like, dancers, in Roblox, or something like that, and yeah. for a one frame, this guy had like a million subscribers, I believe. But there was like this uh, South London 2 video, like he, like I did like Mafia in South London 2. And I seen it for a one frame and I was like proud. Because this game gave like kind of like a very small community. So. That's why I'm. Yeah, that's kind of, you know what I mean. That's why I'm kind of known a little bit. I'm not like Bacon Studios. And honestly, don't get me wrong, Bacon Studios is a good YouTuber. But the actual dude is a human being. I, I don't like, I respect him as a YouTuber, but not a human being. The dude is just messed up in the head in so many different ways. Bacon, if you're what watching, he did, the, he's just messed up in the head. Like, he's toxic, he's 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 a dick. And he's not, and he's like, oh. not even, he's not even 18, bro. Bacon, oh. if you're watching this, like, no disrespect, man. But like, yeah. And I'll be honest too, I am, I, you've seen me, you've seen some of my videos, I get pretty pissed too. But I'm not always in a pissy mood. Well, yeah, okay, yeah, I am. But Adam also is, because he's Adam. Fuck off. Because Adam's on his period. Hey, then, the only person with a period, she's a period here is you. Nah, 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 that's not true. The only person with a period in our gang is Layla. <laughs> Layla, if and you're the only person that can take, take, take the period away for some time. Oh nah, don't don't have to say that again. Layla what if you're fuck was that? nothing nothing. Layla if you if you're watching this I'm sorry. Alright, but anyways. I remember like I just remember I don't know man, I just remember man. But I remember when um the apartments like apartment three especially. Um you used to be able to stick your gun through the wall and just shoot at people in other apartments and all that and it would do damage because walling was a thing. Bro, remember walling? Yeah, that wasn't that long ago, actually. It wasn't that long. That, well, that was like five months ago. It got patched, um, like five months ago. It doesn't feel that long ago, but this is the walling was pretty new. The walling was annoying, bro. What was annoying was I did this myself, so I can't be mad. But you know what? Said what? Because the gun, because the bullets go. Yeah. The bullets are coming from the tip of the gun. Like, I know it's realistic, but in the most of games, to like, prevent walling and shit, it actually, like, kind of shoot from the, like, tool of a player. Yeah. Look at this, like, like, you could, you can, hold on. See, like, how it gets hit, but you can actually do this, like, look. 
Yeah, I'm shooting through oh. the wall now. So you can do that, yeah. But I don't think it does damage. No, it doesn't. It depends, it it depends on how far you are. That you, cannot, that you cannot, like, if you shoot through the wall, it's just gonna block or something at the wall. Yeah. I mean, I know it's real. I mean, in reality, if you shot at a brick wall, it would not go through it. But, like, I'm talking about, like, wood in a door, you know? Yeah, like, I heard that American houses are, like, mm, you know, kind well, yeah. of made out of paper. Because no, you no. can shoot at them and it's gonna went through walls. And no, no, no. Possibly Our houses are... But Our houses are made out of wood. We have bricks on the outside, most of us. Most of us but have in bricks. in Poland, bro, or Germany, especially Germany, when you're living in, like, like, block, in, like, for example, London or something, you have, like, a meter of concrete. So, it won't fucking go through. In Poland, I have, like, a meter of concrete as well. Like, my wall is literally one meter thick. Like, Bro. Three feet thick with like concrete, so you, there is no way you freaking pierce that. Ah, uh, yeah. Aren't y'all's like doors made out of pure metal too? Mm, no. Oh. We have doors. Wait. Wait. You're talking about like the inside or front door? Front door. Like, isn't aren't those aren't, aren't the front doors like made out of pure metal? And no, front doors are made from wood, but they are like um kind of like. Inside of them, there's metal. Oh, but I wait, I'm gonna be right back for like a minute, okay? Bro, you suck, man. We're gonna cut the dog. Okay, I'm back. You're gonna fucking cut that in a uh, editing software. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta cut so much stuff because of you. All right, all right. But all right. so no, doors are not made out of like pure metal. Like at least not mine. But yeah, I like don't... yours are made like of wood or what? Yeah, we have um our apartment doors. I'm pretty sure they're like made out of. They have like a a metal sheeting on them, somewhat. But they, uh, everything is made out of wood, bro, I swear. There's bricks on the outside, but that's not gonna help. Bro, well, you can just, like, take a fucking axe and just destroy every fucking door, bro. But if you do that, we have, like, you know, the right... But if you do that, we have the right to, like, throw lava on you because you're on our property, bro. America is crazy. Yeah, you can fucking throw it in the head without consequences. I know, because they were on your property and trying to get in, so that's understandable. But in Poland, whoa. In Poland, if, if you punch... If, if you're gonna get attacked, will you... A fist, oh, and you pull out the knife and you kill them. You're fucked because in they're gonna screw you in court and they're gonna say it was overusing of the right to, the, you know, the to the defense, to self defense. If you hit me back, you're going to jail. <laughs> Fuck off. Alright. But but if they if they attack you with knife and you use pistol, same situation. I mean, you're not allowed to have a gun, bro. Yeah, but yeah, you are allowed. You can make a permit, but it's like harder. No, 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 yeah. not at all. You guys can't have guns. Even if you have permit, you are too screwed because they gonna like fucking give you million questions. You could, you, they could like analyze every situation, every fucking second of the situation. I mean, I don't understand how you guys are gonna get caught by Polish police. Like, they don't have guns. No, they do. The they higher have, higher uh, ranks do. Higher ranks have guns. The main problem in police is basically the disciplinary system in police that if they fucking start chasing a criminal and the criminal is gonna run away, they are fucked. So they rather not start chasing at all. Introducing but the most if policemen using a gun at any circumstances, there's gonna be the entire like fucking that. commission that's gonna just analyze fucking by hour, for hours, every like fucking split second of the situation, and they're gonna like wait for one little mistake, and they're gonna screw him, and he's probably gonna get like out of his job. 
Plus, yeah. the, you know, the police cars, they are so fucking, like, broken in Poland that most of them, if they would have to, like, you know, like, research, like, you know, check if they are, like, you know, even able to, like, if, if they are proper to, like, use them on the fucking road, like, legally, they would probably not pass, so it's just all, only made on paper. Don't they have, like, literal air horns on the top one? Like, don't they go, like, dee near dee near or something like that? Yeah, like... <laughs> it's funny, it's like, it's like a cartoon police car, where it goes, like, dee near dee near dee near Yeah. Something like that. But in Pol- like, in Poland, if you get on the car, uh, get out of the car when you pull the wheel, it's still gonna be that bad, though. It, it, it's like... Kind of come on. What if, you just, what, if you just, uh, what if you just knock the cop out? Exactly. They won't even fucking trust you because they're gonna fuck be fucked if they do bro. They no, probably just stay in but like Oh uh, yeah. I heard I mean I heard yeah. getting tased is like a pain of like seven. Like no not seven, seventeen. But I doubt that. I'm pretty sure getting tased is a lot more painful. Just yeah, you... but it's like not lethal though. A stab wound is a pain of 32, and giving and um, a, 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 like having birth, I think, is like 60, is like 56, something like that. And dole of pain. So mm -hmm. like, think about that. It's like it's like 17. That's high, but it's not that high, man. What is 100? I don't know. Getting punched in the face is apparently 22, so I doubt that. What is like? The the hundred is like probably just like getting like burned Nothing. alive. The highest is like yeah. sixty, I think, which is getting burned alive. Oh, yeah. And dole of pain, but like twenty two getting punched in the face is apparently a lot more painful than getting taste. What is one? One is like a one is like a splinter or like something like that. Uh -huh. And then three is like a beastie. No no it's like stubbing your toes. Seven Have you, you Seven's a beastie. Wonder. Why do you can get paper cuts? Like, why can you cut yourself with literally a piece of paper? I don't think you've seen, um, whenever they put paper under a microscope, the edges are like sharp as hell, bro. Yes, exactly. Also, I don't because know if you... the, There is like so... The, the edge of the paper is uh, less thick than the edge of a hair, of human hair. So basically, it, it like you know, if something is sharper, it needs less force to like cut through or pierce through something. Yeah. So because of kinetic energy on the top, like you have like multiplied by like a hundred this energy. So you can say put very little force and cut yourself with paper, which is an annoying, very annoying. I hate that stuff. Paper cut is apparently too, which no, I doubt that paper cuts freaking hurt, bro. Bruh. But like, it does. You know, the... Mostly because of bacteria that's getting to the uh, wound, but like, yeah. Now, but, the... nah, but the most painful is a freaking hangnail, bro. Hmm. I don't care, I ripped those things off, bro. They're annoying. But, um, if I'm <laughs> honest, um, I don't know if you actually know this, but, um, pineapple has microscopic needles in them. What do you mean? They have little microscopic needles in them, like, every pineapple. Uh, that's why it's kind of painful to eat like... them. Eat or dream, drink too much like painful juice, your your tongue is gonna like you know start to be like you know what I mean. It's gonna kind of hurt something yeah. because mm, the gonna... pineapple have this acid in them that makes that that your tongue goes like you know what I mean. Yeah, it also makes your um something else taste good. So eat a lot of pineapple for your girlfriend or your wife. Yeah. Do you eat pineapple? Honestly, when we do, yes, but sometimes I don't because of the fucking pain. We could do that like mm, one day before. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's too late now. I already lost it, but it's cool. But um, now let's not talk about that right now. We could talk about okay. how we could talk about how Adam like gets nailed. All right. Okay. I know. I'm not sure you want to talk about, but like, I don't, I'm not sure you want to talk about this, but like, you want to talk about like our rejections or anything like that, how we got like rejected. Okay, sure. But that's a good topic. Okay, start with your rejection. Okay, so, yeah. I've been rejected multiple times, but one of them, this was my ninth grade one, my high school one, I'm going to 10th grade, 
Um, you don't know what that is because you're Polish, but um. So basically, no, you don't. So basically, there was this one girl. We became friends at like the very beginning of school. You know, like, I remember she apparently had a crush on me, and like she asked me like literally like the third day of school. Being stupid, I rejected her because I wanted to know her a bit better. But then later on, I was like, you know, I know her for long enough. But then I asked her out, but then she ended up rejecting me. Which yeah, I I regret saying no. But there was particular something that you like. Oh, about. shout out, shout out. But we're like... not gonna we're not gonna talk about that. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Shout out, you're gay. But like. Okay. Um, we're still friends, and she's moving away, Sally. I'm really gonna miss her. We've had our oh, we've had our ups and downs, but we're still friends at least. But I honestly, I wonder what it would be like if we were together. But it is what it is. Yeah. yeah. All right. What about you? Okay. What about me? Okay. So in eighth grade, there was this girl that was like, I had that crap from that in like eighth grade. Um, and there was like. Nothing really happened on the 8th grade, to be honest. Like, I just had a crush. I, I knew you we were friends on that shit. But, like, in 8th... Fuck, it was kind of months ago. This gay. But, like... When, like, you know, after 8th grade, you could, like, go to, like, different high school because it's fucking war so you can, like, 35 fucking high schools. Um... You can go to. So, yeah. We didn't have, like, contact for, like, a half a year or something and she wants to see me I don't know out of nowhere and I don't know she was like kind of evil I didn't know to be honest what I liked about her she was <laughs> like fucking she was asking for I my know. help he was asking Aiden help me I don't know what to say I'm like bro fuck off okay so that was true stupidity and belief and yeah it turns out she's like a fucking piece of shit. She like drinks or taking drugs. Nah, bro, that, that's embarrassing to be honest. Yeah. And like, he, he would ask me for help from time to time. Like, because, you know, I had got my first girlfriend at that time, which was, you know, the one I was, was Lee, who I met in December. That was my first girlfriend. He was asking for help and all that, because, you know, obviously, if someone has a girlfriend, you're going to ask for their help with girls and all that. But, yeah, he ended yeah. up. He ended up getting rejected, and that sucks. But yeah, I still make oh, fun of him. I, I still make fun of him for his rejection, bro. He acted out an emo girl. She was emo. I was fuck off. She was. Who are nah. you? What are you saying? I, fuck off. At least yeah. I didn't. At least I didn't cry when I got rejected. No, I didn't cry. Bro. You were making this up because I did, bro. It sounded like you were crying though. Okay, but you sounds like. Didn't I block this dude? Why is he joining me, bro? I thought I blocked him. Because he kept joining me and killing me. Oh. Alright, anyways. This anti andrews Alright, anyways. But, like, yeah. Okay. Yeah, cool. it's just, it happens, you know. We all get rejected. We all try, and it turns out failing, but... Here's one hey, thing. Did... What? Have you ever tried to suck your own dick? Yes, I have. There are only two people who have tried to suck their own dick. People who have and fucking liars. Every single dude on the planet has tried to. Yeah. Bro, you quoting. Including you. Pinkwood, the most critical guy. Or like also known as Pinkwoods. Alright. You know. Yeah, that that dude that dude's cool bro. Like watch his video, bro. He's sick. Cool, I like him bro. I'm All watching right. this video. He's doing like videos about like deal dogs and shit. Bro. All right, I and he got this video Bella Dolphin challenged me and he'll get like two fucking four feet long like dildos on his like shoulders. Bro, <laughs> they're 70 pounds. They're so ass. <laughs> all right, Adam, we're gonna start getting to a little bit of more the embarrassing things, all right? I'm, so you don't have to answer this anymore, but I'm gonna go into the embarrassing side a little bit. All right, so what, what, I, what was the reason why you tried to suck your own dick? I know you have. I know, I was horny probably. You were just horny and you just felt like it. For me, it's because someone mentioned it. I was like, bro, he probably, like, you're like, bro, have you ever tried to suck your own dick? I'm like, nah. And so whenever I got home, I actually tried, but I, I figured out I couldn't actually do it. I tried because someone mentioned it. I was like, you know what? I'm yeah, gonna try. Authorities would fucking find you dead like that. They would fucking think that you were a fucking sexual deviant or something. This <laughs> is like that. 
<laughs> bro. I remember I used to like. What did I used to do? I used to do something super embarrassing. I gotta find out. I used to. Oh no, I forgot. But we. I used to do embarrassing stuff as a kid, bro. I remember. I mean, I'm gonna have to bring her for the podcast, Layla, if she wants to do it. But like, she's. We both done some, some embarrassing stuff. I gotta admit, she's done embarrassing shit. I have to. Um. I remember back in elementary, this isn't embarrassing, but me and my friends, we would sometimes just try to walk out of school, but the teachers would always yell at us and get us in trouble. And there was this one kid in kindergarten named Jamari. He would get in trouble all the time. He got separated from us from the carpet, you know. And in American schools in elementary, they make us sit like on a carpet and all that. Mm -hmm. For the smart board, I got a stupid ad. Every five minutes I get one, it's annoying. Um, Is that Rocket League? No, it's Lego. But, um... What was funny was that like we they um, he liked watermelon and yes he was black, um, <laughs> so they they printed a picture of a watermelon on the ground. That's where he would say he ripped it off one day, and I got in trouble for laughing at his dumb ass for laughing at his dumb ass. And then one day he got taken out of the classroom saying Jamari you're getting a spanking and he was and he was crying no until the door got slammed and we were all dying of laughter. He was spanked by a fucking teacher. He said, no, his, his mom probably spanked him. Oh, okay. back in the Back in the days, um, used to be able to, used to be get, um, they used to spank the kids with, like, paddles, bro. You had to have parent permission, though. The teacher had to have parent Bruh. permission to actually whoop them with it. Hmm. In Poland, exactly the same, to be honest. <laughs> but did y'all need parent permission to do that? No. That was fucking... Polish was communist back then, so like, oh yeah, no one gave up. You know, in uh, bro, during the Cold War, like from 1945 to like 89, in Poland there was like communism because of you know Soviet Union. They were basically just liberated, of course in quote, Eastern Europe. So yeah, they didn't even give a fuck. They were just like. Bro, we are on the podcast and you're fucking okay. So, there was like no such a thing as uh, child rights, the child have like rights to not be fucking beaten. That sounds yeah. like that sounds like rape, bro. Huh, huh, huh. Well, nah. So, yeah, Aiden, how long is it the podcast? I don't know. Curious. I don't know how it's going, but um, Actually, let's just keep going, bro. All right, Adam, would you ra would you rather own a lightsaber or have a helper monkey? <laughs> I already own know. A I already know because the answer. No, 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 you take you, one monkey and teach him. No, 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 no. You would have a helper monkey. Fuck off, baby. Cause you are a monkey. <laughs> Fuck off. Alright. You're racist. I choose lightsaber. That's racist. I assume, no, aren't racist. I'm racist. Aren't you the one that usually assumes that minorities are the ones stealing shit? No, but I'm stealing <laughs> shit. So, like, I'm oh, yeah, white. I know that. So, like, you do too, bro. Fuck off. Um, yeah. Okay, maybe. Everyone knows, okay? Uh, Every race. Would you? Alright. So, that's not assuming that race is still shit, but. Everyone. All right. But which would, would you rather be a capitalist or a communist? Mm -hmm. I know the I answer. I know the answer. You'd pick. You would rather be a com. You'd rather be a communist. Of course, bro. Slava, Slava, so Soviet Kisayuda. Slava, Soviet Union, bro. Nah, capitalist or communist? You would rather be a communist. Bro, did you but he watched the Young Sheldon episode when he was like communist or something? I don't know. I just saying you would rather be a communist. Bro, you are American and you didn't watch fucking Young Sheldon. No, because I'm not retarded like you. Alright. Fuck off. <laughs> it's like the most American thing, bro. I like watched the Big Bang Dead Theory, not Young like Sheldon. The most American thing. This is like media guns. People just eat fucking I meat my all my the time. God. There's like no fucking LGBT in the Texas. Everything is nice. No woke people. And that's nice. Woke people can go to LA, suck cock on their pool, Hollywood, Boulevard. 
back in the day, it was, it was easy to rob shops here. Like, you could, you could like, steal some stuff. Like, hey, you gotta pay for those. You gotta pay for those. You are getting your car. You are locking the door. You have all the stuff you didn't pay for. You are driving away. And I have been robbed. It was that easy. You are <laughs> driving away. <laughs> and I have been robbed. But in Poland, you guys are gay. I'm going fucking to lose everything. No. Would you yes. rather? All right, Adam. Would you rather be always itchy or always be naked? Fuck. To be fucking primal times and I'm being naked. Fuck you. I'd rather be naked, bro. I'm not being itchy. I mean, you lie about your like nine-inch penis. Bruh. You you said it's a... nine inch. That's not even bad. That's not even possible, bro. You have to have like you have to be you have to either one be black or two just fucking. Wait, flatter or like you know close like you know what I mean. Okay, bro. Like soft or flatter. Having a nine. No, I don't know it. I don't know, bro. Like black people have like two. They have like a whole twelve inch dick, bro. You got quiet because you know it's true. You know from experience. Yeah, I know from extreme. Okay, you're gay, you're gay. I <laughs> Adam, you're gay. You're gay. I Wait, just... no, 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 I know that from experience. I'm... Adam's gay? I'm talking to someone, bro. I didn't pay much attention, bro. But yeah, I'd rather always be naked. I'm not being itchy, bro. But yeah, but in reality, there's only one person I want to I want, I want, see naked always. Layla. Alright, anyways. Um... Basically, wait, what? Oh, I thought Bias joined, but um, Adam, 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 Adam. Huh? All right, all right. <clears throat> my throat. I'm sorry, man. All right. Would you rather always smell like urine or always smell like manure? Ow! I hit myself. All right. Manure. Yeah, urine. Obviously, no one's gonna smell like manure. Manure, bro. Like urine is just bad, bro. What the fuck is manure? Doo doo. Oh. Alright. Oh my fucking god, that's a hard one. Okay, I believe manure, it's not that, like, it's. It's better than, no. like, shit. Ma manure is shit, bro. I hope you know that. Yeah, that's, so that's better than manure, because shit, you can, like, smell from, like, fucking kilometer. Dude, that's like, what, that's what manure is, bro. I'd rather smell like this. Oh, alright. They're stupid, bro. Alright. Would you rather have the crush of your dreams or have your favorite or have infinite of your favorite appetizer? Now, this one is probably kind of hard for me. If I'm gonna be honest, I already have the crush of my dreams. So, I. I mean, it could end any moment, but I doubt it will. But, um. This would be a tough one if I didn't have Lula. Basically. Cause like, bro, favorite of my appetizer, bro. Like, those freaking chips from like this place called Lopez, bro. Texas Roadhouse that has those potato skins, bro. Oh my god. Oh, but then you have your. I would my favorite fucking appetizer. All right. I mean, I already have the crush of my dreams, so there's no point in it. So I, yeah, I gotta it's go with cool. favorite appetizer. You, 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 you you're fucking not. Fucking infinite skittles. Infinite skittles, bro. Nah. An, Again, about it. an appetizer. An appetizer is usually for like a restaurant, but hey, man, these are appetizers too. Oh my god! All right. Anyways, anyways. Now I'm just gonna go to a regular question. Adam, why do you look like a monkey? Hey, why do you look like an Indian? <laughs> okay, I'm not Indian, but like, bro. So basically, if you guys want to join our gang, just me and him like to roast each other for no reason. It's just fun, bro. Like, cause like I call him a monkey, cause his hair was short and he actually looked like one. Not even trying to be racist, he dead ass looked like one. And Adam, bro, exercising him, bro, no. Bruh. I don't. Well, I'm more of a giga giga because I can really <laughs> say. Fuck, I don't get peace. I have. Ah! Now let's talk about gameplay wise. Who? Oh my god! 
<laughs> who do you think? Who would be better at at just video games, bro? Me and Adam, I, I that's a tough question. We're both good at South London. He's better at me than Future Tops because he hacks. No, I don't talk, I'm just bored of you. I was he, going he like- was literally fucking on, on the fly. Yes, and you were still hitting me, which is hacks, bro. But I- And you were fucking losing with me anyway, so he just sucks at fucking aiming. So for, for, for aim, I think- I, who would that have to go to? You have- you've gone pretty good. I've started to go off a little bit. Give me a Glock E, I'll destroy the server, I know that. Who's but I think I'm- who are we gonna give the aim to? We're gonna give it to both of us, we both have pretty good aim. Now for the IQ. Yeah. Honestly, I'd probably I have, have... Huh? I have better IQ overall. Yeah. Battle IQ, most likely, I would give it to me. Because, like, I've been playing this game longer. I've been battling. And you, you like to just rush your opponent, bro. Let's be honest. Yeah. Alright. It worked, like, 8 out of 10 times. Okay. Now, by far, who has the most weapons? Now, you have... You have the most one of weapon. I have the most individual weapons. Like I have, I have an auto count, which is like a safe, which just has almost like every gun in the game, almost. Okay, but bro, you can fucking alt and shit. Yeah, I mean, but you have like tons of gold dracos. I don't have gold dracos, so that's one. I have one gold draco. Oh uh, yeah, you can easily get more from the freaking shot though. Oh yeah, and I remember oh, when the double bro. barrel was a thing, bro. That gun was so good, bro. Wait, good remove. It got removed, yeah. You can only get them from spawners now. Alright. Adam, did you just die? What? Die, I heard you call. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. Hey, shut up. I'm stuck in the fall in focus, bro. Fuck it off. Shut up. You're you're a much yeah. Alright, but um I'll be honest, what's your Okay. Whenever you go outside, what do you like? What's your favorite thing to do, bro? Like, cause for me, like I said, I'm going outside tomorrow. I'm gonna have fun with these water balloons and just throw them at random people. I'm fucking, I don't know. I like to fucking mess around and trespassing. Yeah. I, America. Like, yesterday, bro. I was fucking trespassing and shit. Oh. Me America is the best place to trespass, bro. Cause like, you can hop these fences. You can get away from the police, bro. Like, you can get into trouble and not even get, you can not even get caught, bro. Cause like. America's just cool. Bro, I remember I showed you that. Bro, fucking to trespass in America. Bro, bro, when they want to bro. bro, remember like back at. Remember like whenever I showed you that video when I broke into that abandoned house, bro? <laughs> oh, yeah, like fucking like on fire, like you know, after the fire. Like, you know. Yeah, I was in seventh grade and my voice was like, alright, hey guys, so um, I broke into this abandoned house and bro. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yeah. Well, then we gonna explore this battle games with my best friends. Here's the, the sex room. That was actually the video. He actually showed me one. Yeah, I showed him the video. Fucking But um, that voice I did it reminds me of this one live stream that Bacon made. He was trying to roast some kid. He was like, bro, this dude. Look at him. He's like, hey. I'll beat your ass, Bacon. Bacon, you're so bad, I'll beat your- And as, and as he was making fun of this kid, he got fucking shot in the back of the head, bro. My, it was so fucking funny, bro. This dude, Bacon, was trying to bro. roast, but he got killed. <laughs> 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 it was the funniest thing I've ever seen. But Bacon's a cool guy, bro. Like, I got to do a nice little RP with him. Like, go sub to that dude, bro. He's a cool guy. But, uh, I sort of found yeah, it funny bro. how he got his ass watching to make fun of somebody, bro. But yeah, I understand why he doesn't open his DMs because I remember one time he did on live, and like there was like 15 black dicks in one picture, bro. Bro. Because he actually opened some fans' DM and that was it, bro. Okay, then I think that we got like more fun, more from for like hour on podcast, I believe, for like yeah. 45 minutes. We got. I think that's a good plan. But, bro, it's 3 a.m. Like... I think we started talking at like one, bro. It's 3 a.m. Uh, okay, so basically, I think like that's a good moment to like uh, kind of end this episode of podcast. Yeah, I think it's time because to end it, bro. We are gonna do more episodes, of course. This is our this was our and, yeah. little pep talk or tomorrow talk, as I like to call it, with Adam. Yeah. That thank was, you, Adam. Like for, fucking best episode, basically. Thank you, Adam, for being a part of my channel and helping me reach 200 subs.
and like I said, thank you all, bro, for helping me get to 200 subs. We're getting there to 1,000, bro. If we get to 1,000, that's like a milestone for me. I really appreciate you guys. I, I'm so glad we got 200 subscribers. Just make sure to like, and if you want more stuff like this, we just talk about, you know, our lives and all that, man. And the stupid yeah. stuff that we used to do as a kid. Gun. Join our gang in the description. Brothers of Destruction. You'll love it, trust me. It's a yeah. very good gang. But I think we're going to end off this episode here. Adam, thanks yeah. for being on the channel. You're gay. No problem, man. Fuck off, don't shoot me. <laughs> okay, okay. But I don't fucking okay, don't, uh, punch me. I'll be talking to you guys okay. in the next video. Who actually came in here, bro? Okay. No one. Hello, I'm fucking studio operator and I suck a lot of dick because I'm cock. Okay. Alright. Well, anyways, we're gonna end off this. We're gonna end off the podcast here. This was just our little. T oh, it's laggy. What? Green screen room. I'm glad to have you guys a part of my channel. Thanks for this milestone. This is our 200 sub subscribers. Peace out, everyone. I love you all.